There is a local back to school event that became a matter of life and death for a Cleveland police officer when his allergic reaction triggered a fast reaction from a quick thinking mother. Here's January Keaton with the story. You saved my life. This is Cleveland Police Sergeant Ray O'Connor thanking a local family for being at the right place at the right time. One stung my left wrist, then another one stung me in my right wrist. August 20th, Sergeant O'Connor was playing football with neighborhood kids at the Ward 5 Back to School Festival at Carver Park Estates. Suddenly, he felt bees stinging him. Sergeant O'Connor has a fatal bee allergy and realized he had left his EpiPen back at the police station. You could feel the venom flow through your body. You could feel your your throat closing, um, everything kind of closes in and starts going dark. Tomika Johnson was volunteering at the festival when she saw Sergeant O'Connor passing out. The six foot seven inch sergeant practically being carried by his partner, Officer Brooklyn Barnes. And I'm only 5'9", so I'm kind of struggling a little bit to carry him. Um, but I knew I had to get him back to the car. He was clutching his chest. Tomika could hear him say the word allergic. He was going into anaphylactic shock. Tomika says her son Zaire is allergic to everything, so she keeps EpiPens all around her house, which is just across the street from the event. I don't even know who I gave the EpiPen to that was tending to the officer, um, Sergeant O'Connor. But I kept yelling, hit him in the hip, hit him in the hip. Well, Officer Barnes did hit O'Connor in the hip, and he was stabilized until EMS arrived. He was taken to the hospital to be checked out, and the next day visited Tomika to say thank you. He now considers the mother of seven, grandmother of 11, his guardian angel. There was a reason she was there, and I mean, without her being there, I wouldn't be standing here. To be a kind to one another, be kind to people, and hopefully I get the same in return. January Keaton, 3 News. Oh, God bless her. Officers believe that football game somehow agitated a beehive in the tree that they were playing under. Witnesses say 10 to 15 people were stung along with Sergeant O'Connor. Everyone is okay, I'm happy to tell you. Tomika and her son Zaire will receive a Citizen Award in October for saving Sergeant O'Connor's life. Uh, very well deserved, Great obviously. Story.